Hey everybody, we are back. I am finally able to share this build with you guys. This was part of the prime time collab that I was involved in. Um, I'm going to leave the info for the Instagram hashtag and all of that in the description box. But basically, um, the theme was to pick your favorite or some TV show or movie that you really like. So I thought doing American Horror Story would be really cool. Um, I love season one. That was my favorite season. And I thought the house is like so beautiful in that uh, show. So I said, let me do this. And this was so difficult to do. Um, it's really, really hard to do a accurate depiction of a house when you're trying to record at the same time as building. Um, there was a lot of pausing and stopping to study the photos that I had pulled up online and trying to figure out what I could use in the game to accurately match um, the actual house. So there's quite a few times where I changed some things around um, just to get it more accurately as I was going through it. I saw something and I was like, oh, this will be good. I can use this and whatnot. So, um, the house is pretty, I guess, I don't want to say plain cause it's certainly not plain, but it doesn't have like a lot of landscaping or a lot going on on the outside. So what I decided to do was I decided to show the house how it is in the show on Halloween night. So on Halloween night, they decorate there. It's a Halloween episode. That's a two part episode. And it's probably my favorite of the series and they have two guys that come that used to live in the house that are currently living in the house as ghosts and they come and they decorate the house for them so the way that the house is done is filled with pumpkins and apples and all kinds of Halloween decorations so I couldn't find any pictures online of that but I did um, go back and rewatch the episode again um, and just well both episodes and just tried to find shots that had the um, decorations for the Halloween in the um, shots so what I did is I just paused the TV and tried to study it and try to figure out what I could use and what I could do so they had all these red flowers lining this walkway here so I did that um, and then I put pumpkins everywhere in the interior the, sh the scenes are filmed in the dining room kitchen and outside mostly for the Halloween episode so those are the ones that I decorated with the Halloween stuff I did put some in the foyer as well so harder than the outside of this house was doing the interior. Um, I searched and searched and searched uh, to find some sort of a layout and um, it was nearly impossible but I found one when I was already started on the interior. I found one on Pinterest actually of both floors and this is a house that's actually um, a real life house. It's in Hollywood, I believe Hollywood but I know it's in California. Um, so this house, I don't know all the history on it, but it's very old and, um, there's people living in it right now, but they're not too thrilled with, they didn't know the house was in the show American Horror Story. So they have a lot of people that go there and take photos outside of the house, which I guess would annoy me. But at the same time, I would think you, you would do your research and I'm surprised that they didn't know before they bought the house. But anyways, that's fine. So I found a floor layout. So I kind of tried to use that to the best of my ability. And I will say this house is humongous. Um, I did not decorate the entire interior. I left like one of the bedrooms open and then there's like a big hallway area upstairs. I didn't do that part. Um, I mean, it has, you know, like wall coverings and wallpaper. I mean, floor coverings and wallpaper and all that, but I didn't fully decorate it. Um, but I did do two of the bathrooms upstairs, two of the bedrooms upstairs, and the study. Um, I also created an attic, which is in the show. I didn't decorate the attic. And then the basement, I did do the basement as well. 
but um, I did put it all in for anybody that wants to download this it is on the gallery and I did put the gazebo out back for anybody that's familiar with the show so I tried my very very best to get all the details in I have so much other stuff going on so um, it was hard for me to try to get everything a hundred percent done but the collab came out today and um, everything's on Instagram the hashtag for the collab is primetime collab um, the girl who organized it I'm so happy she's so, such a sweet person she did such a great job with the idea and with organizing the collab and keeping everybody together um, there's another one that I'm involved in coming out at the end of the month uh, that one I have to kind of keep a secret so I'm really really excited for that one it's going to be I've done plenty of big builds like castles and things like that but this collab build that I did um, that's coming out is on a 50 by 50 lot and it's probably the most involved I did there's a lot of different buildings um, on the lot and there's a lot of different landscaping and I really played with the terrain tool which I'm starting to get a little better at I've been pushing myself to use it and I just had so much fun doing it I love decorating it I love the way um, the landscaping came out you'll see when it comes out but um, that'll be on the 30th or the 31st and uh, yeah that's it I think so there's this collab that collab and then there's a third one that I'm involved in coming out in August so stay tuned please hit that like button and let me know what you guys think I'd love to hear from you and please subscribe if you haven't already so you can see what else I have in store and I hope you all have a great day bye